What quote hangs on your wall? Welcome to the Gold Gavin Quote of the Day. I'm Tony Woodall, your host, and I will share with you a great quote I've heard, read, or that's been shared by one of my guests on Gold Getting Podcast Weekly Show, where I ask, what quote hangs on your wall? Thanks for listening, folks, and I really appreciate it. Hello, Gold Getters, and welcome to Gold Getting Quote of the Day. I'm your host, Tony Woodall, and I want to... Thank you for coming and listening to our podcast today. Whether you're a first-time listener or somebody who keeps coming back because you love our quotes, thank you very much. I'm very grateful that you chose us today. Today's quote is shared by one of our listeners, Hector Mancera from Concord, California. Hector says this quote hangs on his wall of his home gym and his work truck. It is a powerful quote that keeps him moving in times of doubt. The quote is The Man in the Arena by Theodore Roosevelt. It is not the critic who counts, not the man who points out how the strong man stumbles, or where the doer of deeds could have done them better. The credit belongs to the man who is actually in the arena, whose face is marred by dust and sweat and blood, who strives valiantly, who errs, who comes short again and again, because there is no effort without error and shortcoming. But who does actually strive to do the deeds, who knows great enthusiasms, the great devotions, who spends himself in a worthy cause, who at the best knows in the end the triumph of high achievement, and who at the worst, if he fails, at least fails while daring greatly so that his place shall never be with those cold and timid souls who neither know victory nor defeat. Thank you so much for sharing that great quote, Hector. The man in the arena is such a powerful vision. It kind of brings back the uh, vision of the gladiator that fights every day to keep themselves alive, to earn their freedom. Teddy Roosevelt's president soldier, statesman, pioneer, was often in the arena of life. He had many victories and many defeats. His words here, especially the last part about the best and worst, really resonate with me. Who at the best knows, in the end, the triumph of high achievement, and who at worst, if he fails, at least fails while daring greatly, so that his place shall never be with those cold and timid souls who neither know victory nor defeat. The man in the arena knows the triumph of high achievement. They also know that it is better to fail daringly and greatly than to never have the opportunity to experience either because they fear trying. If you have a dream, a goal, go for it. It could be a resounding success, or it could be a supreme failure. At least you will experience one or the other or both but at least you will experience and learn from both. Thank you, Hector. I appreciate you sharing this great quote with our goal-getting quote of the day listeners. It's not about your critics. It's about you, the man in the arena, man being everyone, every gender, the one outdoing the deeds and making it every day. Go out and make today a great day. And if you like this quote from Hector, I certainly encourage you to submit a quote that you find inspiring or motivational to me at Tony at GoalGettingPodcast.com, and I'll put it on the show, give you credit like I just did Hector. Thank you again, Hector. That's a great quote. If you like this quote or others on Goal Getting Quote of the Day, I also want to let you know that I put together a monthly collection of 20 awesome wallpaper-sized images full of great quotes. And you can subscribe to these for just $4.99 a month or just $49 per year. And we'll send you your monthly quote pack to help inspire and motivate you. You can subscribe on our website at goalgettingpodcast.com slash images today and sign up for your Goal Getting Quote Pack. Again, thank you for listening to Goal Getting Quote of the Day. If you like our show, please recommend it to our 
uh, family and friends of yours so that they can take part and stay inspired and motivated. You can follow us on iTunes at goalgettingpodcast.com slash iTunes and subscribe, or you can subscribe to us on Jabbercast, another great podcast listening experience with the Jabbercast app, and you can do that at goalgettingpodcast.com slash Jabbercast. We're also on Twitter and Facebook, and you can find those links on our show notes at goalgettingpodcast.com slash QOD76. That's QOD76. Thank you, and go out and make today a great day. 